and in both places I have my own skincare what do you what's the word um what is the word I have my own <laughs> parang nare-realize ng skin ko na oh mahal pala ako ni Ayin good ewan ko hey guys it's your girlene and this is the channel where we pursue our best selves yet but um For today's video, I want to share with you guys my latest skincare rotation and by that I mean all of the products that I have been using in rotation because I don't have like just one routine for a number of reasons. So number one, I have started in the beauty slash skincare industry because I am now part owner of a beauty brand called Kai Beauty. So skincare and makeup has been a huge part of my career in the last year or so. So I've been trying out a lot of products. I've been more interested in how they've been developing. I've been interested in how beauty brands and skincare brands launch their campaigns. At the same time, I'm interested in the product development process. And so part of my job now is trying out skincare and really getting to know different skincare products. So I'm just, I'm loving it so far. Okay, another thing, another reason is that I have two places that I stay at. So sometimes I'm at the office, sometimes I'm at home. And in both places, I have my own skincare what do you, what's the word? Um, I have my own skincare repertoire, reservoir. Um, what is the word? I have my own, <laughs> like I have my own. Eh. Okay, I have a set of skincare products in specific places. Sometimes I even buy two bottles. Para meron ako at home, meron ako at the office. That explains why I have a skincare rotation as opposed to a skincare routine. That being said, I also want to put a disclaimer, and I'm sure and dami na magtatanong nito. Miss Ayi nakakaputi ba yan? Obviously not, because this is me and I don't use whitening products whatsoever. And so if you are interested in getting to know skincare products that are friendly for Morena girls, Morena boys, Morenas, anything you want to be, well, keep on watching. Shall we begin? Oh, we shall. I actually, this is the perfect time to do my skincare video because I ko lang from a trip and I had to pack a lot of skincare products because I not Anyway, so let's start with the cleansers. I really like going for cleansers that are gentle on the skin. So the first one I want to show you is Cetaphil. I also like Oxycure, but unfortunately, I don't have it with me here. Another cleanser that I really love is the L'Oreal Paris Glycolic Bright Cleanser. Now this one is mostly for the morning naman what I use and also this is what I leave sa office ko. This is what I use here. I love it. I want to try the Sipo Cleanser kasi I've heard great things about it but since I haven't tried it pero ando na siya sa bahay ko. Another product that I really like is the Lana pH Cleanser. Again, I don't have it here because it's in the house. But for right now, these are my two recommendations that are part of my current skincare rotation. And this is my cleanser. Generally, if there's no whitening, I'm going to go there. And you know, gentle. Lang. Next thing that I want to talk about toners so for my toners i once again go with very gentle ones because for the toner parang i want something that's a little more gentle to skin ayoko talaga when it stinks so alcohol free yung mga toners that i go with so the first one is something that i've used for years now the celatec hydration toner and this is really good because if you dry ka around the areas you i don't know you get crusty around the nose area ako i've Notice now when I use this, hindi siya nangyayari. Another toner that I like that has the same effect, although it is a little more pricey and the consistency is more, it's more malapot. It's not like this na medyo parang tubig yung feel niya. Ito medyo mas malapot siya. But this is very hydrating as well. This is the Skin by BYS Extra Hydrating Balancing Toner. So I guess if you have dry skin, this is very good although it's on the pricier side pero feeling ko sulit naman kasi it's 210 ml tas yeah ayun no kalahati pa lang pero ilang beses ko na to nagamit 
And then finally, I also want to share with you guys the Dokdo Toner from Round Lab. This is a Korean skincare brand. I've made a video about it before. I still use it to this day. Ayan, if you guys can see, nakalhati ko na siya. And this is something that I also use here in the office. Whenever I feel like I'm oily, I have more pimples. This is what I use because I don't. Guys, I'm not an expert, but I'm sharing based on my experience. This is what I've been using whenever my skin feels like it needs more support. Alam mo yun? Because <laughs> these ones are like super gentle, super hydrating. Ito pag it needs a little more attention. Okay, let's go to the next category. I feel like I'm speaking super very fast. Super very fast. Okay. Pero kasi ang dami kong da pagdadaanan, guys. Eh. Medyo madami akong <laughs> sinishare. Okay. Next category, serums. Let's go through them one by one. I guess for my daytime serums, I really love the L'Oreal Revitalift Hyaluronic Acid Serum. This is probably like the third bottle that I've owned and binabalik balikan ko siya kasi it's really really good. Anything with hyaluronic acid, I love, but at the same time just um, something that I've learned from my friends. It is great when you want to prep your skin for makeup. Although it is a little expensive, sulit naman siya for me personally. Okay, next one again under makeup. I have two serums that I love from Issy and Co. So these are local serums from a local brand, Issy and Co. I'm sure you guys are familiar with Issy because. I, I use them all the time. So, the two variants that I love. So, this one is the Booster Serum Makeup and Skincare Enhancing Drops. I believe meron siyang. I, I I lost the box with the ingredients list. Sorry. Pero ang difference nilang dalawa is this is what I use when I feel like I have oily skin. As in like extra oily yung skin ko for the day and I don't want to, you know, like, be shiny. Usually, ito yung ginagamit ko pag meron akong events, pag meron akong long day na from day to night, I need my makeup to be on. This is what I'll use kasi this, to me, makes my face less oily. On the other hand, this is what I use whenever I film videos lang and I'm still, and I'm just at the office, I can easily retouch because this one is a little more hydrating than this one. So I guess it depends on what you're looking for. If you're oily, this one. So this is the sebum balancing uh, serum from Issy and Co. And this one is the hydrating and soothing serum. So diba, like very specific for your needs. So again, I use them before makeup. Now let's go to my nighttime serums. I realized I have products that And again, I, I don't use them all at the same time. I use them Depende kung ano kailangan ko. But right now, my favorite na serum for nighttime is the Glycolic Bright Serum from L'Oreal. I've learned from... I had a webinar kasi with the Nerdy Derma. This is really good if you want to lighten dark spots. And if you're morena, very susceptible tayo to having dark spots, especially when we have acne or when we have pimples. You know how we get scars? Kasi ganun ako eh. Like, if I have a pimple, talagang nagda-darken siya because that's just how my skin is. And the Glycolic Bright Acid, sorry, Glycolic Bright Serum from L'Oreal helps me out with that. As in, I've been observing kung itong pimple ko dito, kung gano katagal bago siya mawawala. And about a couple of days, as in, nag, nag lalaitan talaga yung dark spot ko na yun, which is great because it doesn't change my skin tone, but it addresses the dark spots that I've been getting whenever I would break out. So, love this so much. Ito yung panggabi ko. And usually, if kailang ko talaga, if I have a lot more like dark spots because of yung nga break out nga ako because of stress, lack of sleep, or dirt, or just whatever reason. This is what I've been reaching out for. I can use it pag gabi and pag umaga, but mostly sa gabi. Like, I prioritize it at night. Pero pag umaga, like sometimes yes, sometimes no, pero mostly gabi. <laughs> okay, and then finally, this is the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. If I want something that's a little more hydrating, a little more 
soothing, feels like medyo healing, ganyan, anti-aging. This is what I reach out for. It's a small bottle. I got it via PR. Pero ang dami ko na kasi nahuwang packages from Estee Lauder. So, fortunately, I haven't had to purchase it. Pero love na love namin to ng mom ko. Because sobrang soothing niya. Like, when you wake up in the morning, ang ganda ng feeling. So, yeah. If you have somebody who wants something more parang anti-aging, ganyan. Ewan ko. Parang yun yung ano niya. Like, that's how... I guess it's been marketed or yun yung vibes na my mom and I are getting from this because um, it's just super social and it feels great on the skin but okay reading from the back of the bottle it's for all skin types and you can apply it in the morning and at night before the moisturizer so pwede pala siya for both pero mostly I use it at night so anyway, yun yung five serums that I've been rotating. Oh my gosh, and dami. <laughs> Ngayon lang nag sink in sa akin. Okay, so let's go to moisturizers. Let's go to moisturizers. I have a couple. So the first one that I want to talk about is the Celatec Hydration Facial Moisturizer. Ito yung first brand, I guess, that I really love for my skin. If you go back to my skincare videos from a few years back, Celatec yung ginagamit ko. And I, ca I think I'll of all of the products that I'll show, at the most affordable. So this has been like a go-to for me. Parang it's it's really a staple for me. And minsan madalas pag magta travel ako, ito yung dinadala ko because it's quite easy to get and easy to purchase as well. Available sa drugstores and everywhere else. But if I want a little more care, I have been loving the Sipo True Do Brightening Gel Cream. It's great before makeup and it's great at night as well. Like it's very moisturizing. Pagising ko, I feel like a new person. I feel like I have like baby skin. Pero under makeup, it's stunning. Kasi ang ganda ng lapat ng foundation ko whenever I use this. So yeah, check it out. It's also a local brand and I love it. Yung isa pang moisturizer from a local brand that I love is from Lana. Pero in Narbor ng kapatid ko, it's um there they only have one moisturizer. So if you go to the Lana PH page, yeah, kinuha ni Elian kasi <laughs> she was like, "Oh my gosh, this is so good because she has very sensitive skin and she needs like a gentle moisturizer." So kinuha niya yung Lana PH moisturizer ko. So yun, that's another local brand that I really recommend. And it's owned by Madam Riza Lana Sebastian. Okay. And then let's go to, syempre, I have the whole set of the Glycolic Bright range from L'Oreal. So, I have been loving this as well. Um, the Glycolic Bright Night Cream and Day Cream. So, this is also part of my rotation. I keep this at the office. Now, ayan, specific siya for day and night because the day cream has SPF 17, so a little more sun protection. And then, ito, the night cream, they have it as well. Now, I love using this, especially with the uh, Glycolic Bright Serum because they're just like made to complement each other. And so, if I have those days na I really want to target my dark spots, this is what I do. This is the combo that I use. But yeah, I leave these sa office because I'm usually sleeping here some nights and I want to have these on hand. And it's beautiful. Niya. All right, so next category, let's go to face oils. I love face oils because contrary to what I used to think, that I thought face oils are not for oily skin because I have oily skin. But face oils actually make my face less oily, but I only use them at night. So ayun, that's, I guess, the caveat use them at night. So the first one that I want to talk about is my Ride or Die from Lana PH Argan Oil. Ito yung pagka nagtatampo sa akin yung skin ko kasi kung ano-ano pinagagawa ko. I use the Argan Oil and it's just super duper soothing and parang feeling ko ito yung binabal parang whenever my skin is like not in its best state whenever I use Argan Oil it's just hmm set up. As in, parang, parang nare-realize ng skin ko na, oh, mahal pala ako ni Ayin. Ewan ko. Anyway, so super hiyang ako sa argan oil ng Lana. Sobrang daming bottles na nagamit na ko neto. So, I love it talaga. 
The other one that I like is from Pili Ani. This is the self care night recovery oil. And I love this. Ito pala yung cover niya. I love this because you only need two to three drops. Tapos it goes a long way. As in, ilang beses ko na to nagamit, pero it's as if hindi pa siya nababawasan. So, sulut siya sobra. And even though it's a little pricey, it is actually very, very soothing on your skin. And it's also good for like, whenever my skin feels dehydrated, I reach for this. Ito din yung iniiwan ko sa office. Ito yung nandito. It feels great on the skin. It's made with Pili oil and Elemi oil. So yeah. Um, iba yung consistency niya with the Argan oil. Argan oil is a little more malapot. This one is a little more malabnao. If that makes sense. But anyway, both are really good and it depends on your needs. I would say if you have oily skin and medyo hindi ka sanay sa putting oil on your face, you can start with a Pili Ani. And then finally, uh, this is from Nus Pari. It's the Wheel Prohibition. I can't pronounce it. It's literally H U I L E P R O D I G I E U S E. It's a French brand. I don't want to butcher it, but this is the face oil. I actually got it from a PR kit, uh, I think, I believe, Sephora. But. This was the face oil that I used to use in Spain. So this one I only use on special occasions when I want to feel luxurious. Kasi iba yung scent niya. As in yung, yung scent niya parang hotel. As in para kong mayama <laughs> whenever I use this. So it has more or less the same effect as the PV Ani and the Lana PH Argan Oil. Except this one, the scent talaga is like so luxurious so if i want to give myself that treat i use this and the unique thing about this is i can use it on my face my body and also my hair so i actually use this on my hair sometimes but i will go to that later on a different video because i actually use different stuff on my hair so kung gusto niyo ng skin ng hair routine or hair root rotation a video let me know in the comments because I have some for you guys as well okay next after face oils ano pa ba? um masks let's talk about the masks that I use for my regular almost everyday mask I use the Laneige water sleeping mask underscore X but my underscore X I don't I don't know why I'm nakalagay underscore X dito but it says that. Ngayon ko lang yun napansin. But anyway, I use this at the very end of my nighttime routine and it's just amazing. Now, alternately, like three to four times, actually four times a week, I would use the Saipo Superfood Face Mask. So, brang gusto ko. Guys, this is like my favorite skincare product recently. As in like, this is my current favorite. As in, grabe ako makastock up dito. So if you look at it, it's powder form. It's actually a powder and it is made of spirulina, chlorella, and wheatgrass. So pag inamoy mo siya, it smells a little earthy. Para siyang, alam mo yun, hinarvest sa garden or sa farm. It smells like a farm. <laughs> and then what I do is, I put it, like I put maybe two teaspoons, kasi may scooper siya, two scoops in a bowl. And I add one scoop of the same Saem, same uh, Jeju Fresh Aloe Soothing Gel. I got this from my ina anak. Hi, Darcy. So I got this from my ina anak. Regalo niya to sa akin, di ba? May, may regalo sa akin yung ina anak ko. But anyway, she got me this. And I've been using this aloe vera gel to mix with the Saipo Superfood Face Mask. Tapos, I use it like four times a week. Tapos, <laughs> Grabe talaga. Yung effect niya very parang tightening sa skin. Tapos, ano lang. To me, it's kind of like a ritual that I love to do. Because it makes me feel relaxed. And it makes me feel like I'm treating myself. Super set up ng feeling. So yun, before hindi ako mahilig sa mask. But now I am. Okay, but the difference between the two of them. The Laneige one, I use at the very end of my nighttime routine. The Saipo one I use at the beginning. So right after cleansing my face with a cleanser, I put the mask agad. And then after 20 minutes, I wash it off. 
Tapos, I continue with toner, serum, moisturizer, etc. So, again, this is at the end. This is at the beginning of the nighttime routine. Eye cream. I only use one eye cream at the moment. This is from Good Molecules. It is the Yerba Mate Wake Up Eye Gel. You can use it both day and night and it's a great way to prime your eyes especially if you get creases under it and kailangan hydrated yung eyes mo for concealer and makeup etc. I love it. For my lips naman, I've been using the Petroleum Jelly regular petroleum jelly the vaseline one which unfortunately i don't have at the moment but i also use the laneige lip sleeping mask Eto, it smells like bubble gum tbh it's apple lime but it smells like bubble gum Bango talaga niya. and yeah i use it pag nasa bahay ako kasi it really feels like a treat basta i always need something to go on my lips overnight because otherwise like nagka crack talaga yung lips ko. So yeah, petroleum jelly, Vaseline that works. Pero kung gusto mo a little more luxurious, Laneige. Um another product na I like is Lucas Papau ointment. Ito yung pang daytime naman na moisturizer ng lips ko. Let's talk about sunscreen. <laughs> Ah, uh, For my sunscreen, I have a couple of recommendations. Let's start with the Lana PH Skin Protect Brightening Sunblock. This one, out of everything, is the most affordable option. It's also a local brand, so support, support, Taijan. I love this because the consistency really goes a long way. My only problem is it's not sweat proof. So, pagka nag work out ako, uh, medyo na si silam ako. Pero, it's really good and it's really good for the price as well. Under makeup, I love to use the Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen SPF 40. Kasi, ang ganda niyang primer. And, a lot of content creators also say na maganda siya under makeup. Pero, mahal lang siya. So, ayun. <laughs> Next one is Anessa. So, yung Anessa naman, Love na love ko talaga yung Anessa sunscreens. And I have two variants. So the first one is the milk variant. And kaya ito kailangan mo i-shake. Ayun, kailangan mo siya i-shake before you use it. Ang consistency niya is kind of like, para siyang medyo matubig. Pero ang finish niya when it sets, it's matte. Now, the other one, very powdery yung finish niya when, once it sets. So, if you have oily skin, maybe go for this one. However, if you have dry skin or if you want a dewy finish, I would recommend going for the, the gel sunscreen. This is SPF 50 as well. So, ayan. Ganyan, yun, ganyan siya. Tapos, ang finish niya is parang dewy skin kind of look. So if you want yung mga dewy dewy looks, this is what you go for. However, I would have to say na if hindi ka sanay, like in the first two minutes, meron siyang white cast, pero nawawala rin naman siya. So, okay lang. Like, I, I still recommend them. As in super, I love these. I love these sunscreens. Um, I would have to say na Super Goop and Anessa are pricey. So, go for it if Gusto mo mag invest and gusto mo ng, you know, a little treat. Pero medyo mahal siya. Pero, mm, sa akin worth it kasi siya. Eh. Pero, if you want a more affordable option, Lana PH is really good as well. So, yan lang, guys. Ito, gusto ko sila because they're sweat proof and waterproof. So, kahit mag workout ako, it works out. But then, for me, so, ayun. So anyway, that is it for my skincare rotation video. I hope you guys got something out of it. I don't know if I said a lot of things that didn't make sense or if, I don't know. I just I just shared my thoughts and opinions. Again, I am not an expert at skincare. I am a consumer slash an enthusiast who is exploring skincare very slowly but also very aggressively so thank you guys so much for watching if you have any recommendations for me let them, let me know in the comments down below if you haven't subscribed yet subscribe and click the bell button for more videos on morena skincare morena beauty etc thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you on the next one bye stay confident